We previously saw a couple videos on how to create new objects at runtime and how to create random objects. In this case, we're going to see how to create an object and place it in a random position. Subscribe to support this content and let's start solving this problem. This is the prefab that we are going to create and place it in a random position. So first, let's create a new script and an empty game object to assign it. Inside the script, we are going to define a game object variable. In Unity, assign the prefab in that variable. And then in the start function, we are going to call the instantiate function passing our object as parameter. You press play and as you can see, our prefab is created. Now, how we can place our object in a random position? One way to do it could be create a couple empty game objects to use as the positions where the new object could be placed. I create all these objects as a child of another game object to keep the hierarchy organized. I will also add an icon to these objects and with this button enable gizmos in the game window. This way we could see the possible positions. Now, inside the script, let's define an array of game objects. Call it for example, possible positions. Go to Unity and set the appropriate size for the array and drag each object to one of the fields in the array. Now we need to generate a random number between 0 and the size of the array minus 1 and use that number to access to an element of the array. We can do that with the random.range function, passing 0 and the size of the array as parameter. Use that number to access to an element of the array. So here you have one of the empty game objects chosen at random. We just need to use the position of this random object to place the object that we create with the instantiate function. For example, using an overload of the instantiate function that requires three parameters, the object to make a copy, a position and a rotation. Press play a couple times and it should be working. Subscribe to this channel so we can see each other again in the next video.